Finally, this evening, the JSC and the RAND showed little movement on Friday morning as investors awaited a crucial U.S. inflation report. The All Share Index closed at a record high of 87,327 points, buoyed by positive U.S. economic data. The RAND held firm, reaching an intraday high of 17 rand and 13 cents against the dollar. Meanwhile, on the on the stock market, the top 40 index dipped by 0.4%, while South Africa's 2030 government bond strengthened, with heels down to 8.79%. But fellow manager Gabriela Tula provides a recap of the week's market performance. Well, another incredible week has come to an end uh, on this Friday. We've seen uh, tremendous gains, especially from uh, big heavyweights on the JSC index, the likes of Richmond, the likes of Naspers and Process, and uh, the mining companies, Anglos and BHP have given north of uh, 8% just in this particular week. And we uh, reading into this that there's obviously uh, good momentum coming from the interest rate cuts that we've seen. And really from a tra trajectory point of view, this is boding well for, for both industrial as well as uh, mining companies. So it's been a, a, a very big day today as well with the all share adding 0.4% uh, percentage wise, not that big, but considering that we're trading at all time highs, um, the market does continue to move higher and higher unabated at this point. And the currency uh, currently sitting at uh, 17 Rand and 12 cents, uh, it had touched 17 Rand and 5 cents uh, earlier I had looked. So the Rand looking very strong at this point. Um, also. Uh, confirming that sentiment that we're seeing that it is indeed a positive uh, move that we've seen from the central banks. Uh, just to give you some names, even on this particular day, the likes of Baldwin up uh, 1%, the likes of EOH Old Mutual up 8 and 4% respectively. So a great close to the week. Uh, we, we hope the momentum continues into the new week.